Hey guys, this is Pixel Dan, and I'm coming to you from the Toy Man Toy Show in Bridgeton, Missouri. And I'm standing here with my main man, Jeremy Corey of World Event Productions. What's up, dude? It's Pixel Dan, and he's here in St. Louis. When last we talked, we were out there at Comic Con. San Diego is the How last time we hung out. How did you get out of my computer and into the real world in some kind of strange Magic. Tron thing <laughs> that's, that's, what that's going on? Volt. I am, I'm thrilled to see you here, man, and I, thank you for coming I by. I think it's awesome that Toy you're... Man. Yeah, it's our first year here at Toy Man, and uh, we're having a great reception. Bonds, kids and everybody coming to see a hometown hero right? in Voltron. Right, yeah, because you're right around here in the St. Louis area. Yeah, right? Absolutely. It was just a quick little jaunt up. We packed up our blazing swords. We <laughs> put in our uh, Spen helmets. We grabbed our Pidge hair braids and uh, told the space mice to wake up early. It's time to get in the van <laughs> and uh, drive all the way uh, here to Bridgeton at the Machine Hall. You got Hall. everything in that van? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we were able to get everything in that van through uh, technology. We're selling our jerseys. We had a really fun time with these uh, Voltron Hall. Halloween costumes. Yeah, what, what, you got like yeah, these costumes? Yeah. You know, look at this costume. It's, it's not like our giant mascot costume, but I got to tell you, I personally wore that to a, uh, a get-together, a gathering, and uh, it went over like gangbusters. Rainbow Bright came up and gave me a hug. So that was Wow, you can pick up yeah. Rainbow Bright with this? It was, it was some, yeah, maybe we could form together and just, you know, <laughs> turn into some kind of 80s retro uh, thing. So uh, we've got shirts and everything. We're having, a, we're having a good time. But you and I, we're here to talk about the Maddie Collector run. That's Voltron right. Classics. I can't believe it's over. It's already. over. It's done. It's Black Lion's out. Everybody's been able to build this massive thing. That thing. It's like a small child. I love it. It truly is, you know, what I would call the ultimate Voltron toy. I had you to put know? it in a car seat to get it here. <laughs> and then you got pulled over. <laughs> and they were like, what's wrong with your child? Yeah, yeah I hear you. So uh, what do you think uh, overall coming from the front lines? I've seen a lot of your videos. I know you have some yeah. pluses and you have some minuses. Pluses? Yep. Yeah, what, what, what goes in the picture? All right, man? so I'm sure if anybody that has seen my video by now, and if you haven't, Pixel-Dan.com. Go see my videos. Watch my reviews. So the size, of course, totally epic. Right. 23 epic inches tall. Oh, my gosh. It's like I've always wanted a Voltron that was this size. But, I mean, you can kind of see how he's, he's got, like, the little cool, like, Voltron gangsta lean thing going yeah, on there. Gangnam style. <laughs> there you go. Um, he is a little top-heavy. He does have some problems standing up, and I know a lot of people have kind of said the same things about theirs. But you can find, you know, the right way to kind of maneuver him around. He's got good articulation in the legs, which is nice. You can you get some good poses out like of him. Yeah. yeah, so you can get some pretty good poses out of him. Um, but the top heaviness is a minor problem. I think the thing I don't like the most is the legs that shoot out, the spring-loaded legs. Right, right. My blue line that. is he's just always shooting out, so... Well, you know, it's interesting, and, and as I'm sure you've talked to Scott at Mat Maddie and everything, we we really sat and said, okay, we want to go into a time machine, and we want to say, what would the six-year-old version of me think was the coolest Voltron <laughs> toy ever? Right. And so it was really kind of controversial. Okay, do we take a step more and make it this more of a kind of a collector's thing? You know, and we said, you know what, let's just make the toy we always wanted as a kid. So right. that kind of spring action feature, you know, that's what Brandon, uh, one of the toy designers at Mattel, wanted to put in, and uh, I think it's great for that play value, and I I think if, you know, all the cool parents out there who happen to let their sons or daughters play with their Voltron and Maddie Collector understand that that is one of the cool things. You just pop it out. And, hey, you know, you can form this head all day, right? That, right, yeah, you just push the button. That is fun to do the form the head thing, absolutely. Yes. Yeah, right? Anytime you're in a head. bad mood, anytime you're on the border of suicide <laughs> or depression, you just do that in your office, and uh, and it's all good. It does make quite an epic office piece, I it must is, say. Yes. And the fact that you can put the figures inside. So to me, you know, Mattel answered all the challenges and they gave us everything we wanted out of Voltron Toy. As you can see, my son here just totally digging Hey, off. what do you think of this awesome what do you Voltron? Think of Voltron? Huh? You think it's There's cool? a microphone in your face. What do you think of Voltron? Diego, what do you say? Good. Good? good? Just good? Say, just it's, say it's epic, man. Say it's freaking epic. It's freaking epic. Yeah! Freaking epic. Parent of the year. Parent of the year. Thank you. Thank you. You want to see it? Okay. Let's Kid, it yeah, definitely. Like, that's one thing I do think is really cool about this is kids will love this thing. As I mean, it's right here. As we, like proof like right here. Yes. It's like catnip for four-year-olds. They <laughs> just come over and they start playing with it. And it's it's nice and big and, like, you know, it's huge in their hands. So you got, like, this huge, like, chunky lions that they can kind of bash around together and everything. Right. So. right. And from the retro packaging, I mean, they just went the extra mile doing the bubble, you know, pop out and things. To me, it was a really successful line. I just, you know, obviously the fans have uh, responded with it selling out, like, Black Lion. We sold out in, like, 19 minutes. Everybody's trying to get a Black Lion right now. Isn't that crazy? We can't even get a Black Lion. 
mine right now. I haven't sent them to the Voltron offices. So uh, like, I had to bring my I Voltron. Know, this is actually Pixel Dad. <laughs> so come on, right? That's how rare they are. So this is going to be one of those things for years to come. So um, so we'll see. I mean, the future is bright. Voltron's 30th anniversary is coming up in 2014. Ooh. So we might have some fun stuff on the horizon. But to me, uh, Maddie Collector, and I've told Scott this when we were up at New York Comic Con, I mean, they just did such a phenomenal job. And uh, epic is the word to, uh, to describe that. And the fact you can put these highly articulate figures in it uh, yeah. works. So whether you're uh, in or out on the uh, play action features, I, I, I certainly understand that point of view. But uh, to me, uh, it's uh, nothing but epic. Awesome. Form the head, ready? All right, form the head. You gotta say form the head. Yeah, you gotta ready? say it. You gotta say, and I'll form the head, and you push that. And I'll form the head. Push it hard. Yeah! Awesome! Yeah. Cool, Diego, turn around for the camera. See, now this is what's awesome. I mean, you get, like, the next generation of Voltron fans exactly. playing with the Maddie Collector Voltron. Diego, what's your favorite lion and, and character? Uh, Blue. Blue? What's your favorite character from Voltron Force? Uh, Keith. Keith, Keith. okay. Yeah, cool. Keith Man, very cool. cool. What's your favorite formation from Voltron Force? Red Center, Blue Center, Yellow Center? Red Center. Why is that? What does Red Center have? Fire. What, what weapons? Fire. Cool. Store. There you go. That's what it is about. It's about the next generation. Okay, Absolutely. ready? Let's form the head one more time. How can we form? How can we? How can? How can we turn the line, the, the the body to a line? You want to go to a line? Okay, we'll do that later when we're not rolling tape. <laughs> he just wants to play to with it. it. Yeah, he just look. He doesn't have a head. Fix it. Fix it. You no. Say it. no. Come on. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he just okay, keeps putting it back. back See, know, look, right? there's proof right there. Like it is. Don't do oh. no. Why not? Don't form the head? No. Don't no, don't form the head. No. <laughs> this Why is amazing. Like that? That's not intimidating to a robust. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, this hey, is our, our intern for the year here. All right, I'm going to put it back. <laughs> so, so, yeah, like, okay, so the year's rounded out now. We have a full Voltron. You said 30th anniversary is coming up in 2014. Is there anything, like, really exciting Nothing happening? Nothing to announce yet, but we're working. We're talking to some exciting uh, uh, folks. And, uh, look, you know, the love for Voltron, thanks to folks like you, keeping it alive out there and the people that have come and visited us, it's it's awesome. So uh, so we're going to make something work. We've got, we've got some things in the works. You're still looking for that live-action movie, right? It could all kind of play into this. We could be Voltroning these events together, you could say. Yes. Oh, maybe that's the great. Black Lion. Oh, maybe that is the Black Lion. Awesome. Well, Jeremy, thank you once again. Hold on. We'll go potty in a second. Thanks for playing Voltron with us. <laughs> Diego, can you say bye to Pixel Dan? Say, say bye. Say the play action snap feature is awesome. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Well, Jeremy, thank you very Sorry, much. You just got schooled by my no, four-year-old. That's totally cool, man. Hey, <laughs> kids playing with Voltron. That's what it's all about, right? It's all about. All right. Awesome. Cool. Say all right. Bye, internet. Bye. Bye, everybody. Say bye, everybody online. <laughs>